What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the best MMA channel on YouTube, man. How y'all doing? Today, I have like an investigation video. I'm going to find out what's the best opponent for Conor McGregor, you know. I got the Conor McGregor shirt on, you know. I got that shit on right now. Y'all know me. I'm going to tell y'all like, which fight is the perfect fight right now for Conor McGregor. Islam Makhachev. Islam said he would fight McGregor. He said... Why not? It's easy money. So he said yes. He said who in their right m mind would turn a McGregor fight? He said it's an easy fight and it's going to do the most money. So why not? But for McGregor, we're going to look which fight right now he can win. That's my point in this video. Find out the best fight that he can win and he can gain something from it. Islam Makhachev, low risk because everybody expects him to get whooped. It's high reward. He gets the belt, he beats the Dagestani, he avenges the Khabib loss, kinda, because Khabib is gonna be in the corner. But Islam beats him. I'm putting the X on this fight. I don't want this fight to happen next. It shouldn't happen next. As a McGregor fan who's also Armenian, Arman is the only man alive right now that can beat Islam. Nobody else. Oh, except Ilya Topuria. I think Ilya can beat Islam in the future. But right now, Arman is the only one who has the potential, and I believe Arman will beat him. Let's cancel McGregor, Islam Makhachev. Second fight, McGregor, Charles Oliveira. Charles Oliveira wants that money fight too. Come with money, brother. Let's go. <laughs> Oliveira has been speaking about McGregor for years. He wants that fight. If he beats Michael Chandler, knocks him out, McGregor, Oliveira, it's going to be a money fight, you know, two big stars, main event. Big money fight, risk, I mean, it, there's a high reward, if he beats Oliveira, he earns the title shot, right? But, you know, it's a hard fight, it's a hard fight. Charles Oliveira, not only he can submit him, he can only he can also catch him with a takedown, fight, with a variety of shots. Don't forget, Conor McGregor is not the same McGregor, he's not the same karate stance McGregor, the amazing footwork McGregor. This is right now... Flat-footed McGregor, he's almost like stuck in the mud almost. Too stiff, too slow, stuck in the mud. You remember when he said that about Cerrone in the whole 155ers? Now he's one of the too stiff, too slow, stuck in the mud people. He is one of them. He's flat-footed. Charles Oliveira, he finishes him. Submission or what, I don't know. Charles Oliveira beats him too, safe to say. I'm sorry. But, third fight. This is the fight that's gonna that I hope it happens because it makes the most sense. This fight, Dan Hooker, nobody talked about this. Everybody was saying who should Dan Hooker fight next, Oliveira or Arman? Dan Hooker and Conor McGregor. Put Dan Hooker against Conor McGregor, main event. Dan Hooker gets a lot of money from it, and if he beats Conor, then he can fight for the title, and it's an easy fight for Dan Hooker, and. For McGregor's comeback, easier fight than Michael Chandler. Michael Chandler knocked out Dan Hooker. Gamrot dropped Dan Hooker. So McGregor can drop him, can finish him. If he slightly as good as old Conor McGregor, he should beat Dan Hooker. And Dan Hooker is number 5 right now because he beat Gamrot. Easiest way to get back in top 5, to get back in the rankings, get top 5. The easiest number 1 contender fight for Conor McGregor. It's going to generate a lot of money. All Australian people go support Dan Hooker. Dan Hooker got an easy fight and the number one contender as well for him. He prefers fighting him to fight Oliveira or Armand Sarukian. He prefers fighting Conor McGregor and the money fight. For Conor, it's an easy fight too. This fight makes sense. This fight should happen 100,000 trillion million percent. And I got Conor McGregor by KO. I think McGregor can snipe him. After that, put McGregor for the title McGregor Islam this is literally if the UFC are smart if they have any kind of brain this is the fight McGregor Islam McGregor against Dan Hooker McGregor wins put him against Islam don't do Moicano Dan Hooker I mean it's a good fight but you want McGregor back to where he was put him against Dan Hooker that's an easy fight if Dan Hooker wins then Dan Hooker He's gonna get money, his name is gonna get bigger, he's a fun fighter, he doesn't shoot takedowns, he's a fun fighter, so hey, you set up Dan Hooker for the title, you, you give him a, you give him a title fight. 
I hope McGregor sees this uh, is like, yes, I want Dan Hooker. I hope the UFC sees this and they're like, you know, good thinking. So I hope it happens. That's it for today's video. Like, subscribe, go watch the last video. I did fights to make after UFC 307. Make sure to watch it and peace.